Greetings everyone, today is Monday, February 21st, 2022. I'm standing here in Green Coast Springs, Florida at the busiest intersection in Green Coast Springs, which is Orange Avenue and Ferris Street, which is actually State Road 17 and State Road 16. It's a very busy intersection. Like I said, it's the busiest intersection in the state of, or the city of Green Coast Springs. And I'm gonna stand out here with my <laughs> I Love Smith v. Cumming sign. I love Smith v. Cumming, Georgia. Continue my outreach to educate people about Smith v. Cumming case law, which codified and firmly established our right to record police officers and public officials in the course of their duty. We have a right to know what's being done on our behalf and our expense. Smith v. Cumming, it's um, case law from uh, Cumming, Georgia. That's how the city spells its name, C-U-M-M-I-N-G, Cumming, Georgia. And uh, it's case law from the federal courts that codified our right to film law enforcement officers. Okay, It cool. established the right. That's all. That's yeah. all I'm doing, man. Hello, yes, I had a question, if I could, for, I guess, an officer or something like that. This is Stephen from down at the coffee shop in Grinko. Okay, what's going on? Um, we just have a, a person, um, and we just had a couple of complaints, I guess, from customers, and there's a person holding a sign that was disturbing to them, and it just happens to be right in front of our, our store. And I was wondering if there's like a... Is, if, is there anything we could do to ask him to like not be in front of our store? <clears throat> or uh, he said that um, he can be there if he wants to because it's public property. And okay, so I don't um, know what to do about it. What kind of sign is it? Um, it's just it's explicit, kind of. So does it say something specific? Um, yeah, it just says I love coming. And he's standing right in front of our store, which is annoying. How do we get that guy, right? I don't know. What was your name one more time for me? Steven. Steven. And a callback number? 904. Okay. So he's standing on the corner right there? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'll come up to the area. <laughs> How y'all doing? How you doing? Good. All right. All right, so what's the purpose of you standing here? We're we're the speech. To get across. 
Big mistake. That's good. Well, why don't you write this in big letters instead of I love coming? It's uh, being a hitter. It's being a mistake. Well, I'm asking you a question. I know what it is. Yeah. But why don't you write Smith B. Georgia dot in big letters versus I love coming yeah. when you got Whoops. women. Well, it's just freedom of speech, man. Even if I didn't have anything written on there. I'm not denying that, but I mean... You ever heard of Cumming, Georgia? I don't know, I don't know what Cumming, Georgia is. Yeah, that's how they spell their name, Cumming, Georgia. Okay. Well, I mean, my question is, why such big letters with the vote? I mean... It's not I'm, vulgar, it's I'm, how I'm, it's the city is it's coming Georgia. Listen, I understand. Yeah. Women and children to come here, they're the ones complaining. I've I don't have, a few times. I'm I can't help it if they have dirty I minds. It. I can't help it if they have dirty minds. You know what you're doing. Yeah, you know what you're doing. Come on. I, I can't help it if you, you have if nothing if, better to do than you, be one of those people. I can't help it if I mean, they got seriously. dirty minds. Look, look, you're not going to stand here and judge me. No All right. I'm not judging you. Know. All right, you already called me a name one time. What'd I call you? You called me a name, I got it on video. What'd I call you? When you first, when you first walked up, I what can't remember I the you? specific thing you called me, but can't? you already called me a name. You're, you're uh, Officer what? Dickman? Yeah. Good thing we have video. Make sure you spell it right. Where's your, you, are you guys recording? That's our business. No, it's Wait. not just your business. I want to know if is, you're recording. Are you recording? Are you recording? Are, are you, you too recording? stupid to answer my question? No, I'm not. Can you answer sir. her question if she's too stupid to answer it? I'm not too stupid, sir. Look, you're getting nervous. I can tell uh, on your look, face because you're starting to Why don't you guys fuck off? Why don't you guys fuck off? Is that it, from the way it looks? I don't right? give a shit what you're saying. How about that? Turn around and fuck off. How about that? That's on recording too. Okay. Fuck off. So you're gonna post that, showing how you treat other people? Let me ask you this. I'm not interested in be, questions. So, I'm, I'm not. I'm not interested. I'm still gonna ask you because that's what I'm gonna do. What are you gonna do? What do you think? Would it be any problem? Would it be any problem if you go Are you the other side? Are you no, I'm asking because put behind some of you better back your ass off. You're the one that's being threatened. Do you understand that? Why are you We're just approaching you. Why are you saying that? I don't think you're here. I don't think you're here. right here where you're standing are you on sure the about other that? side yes sir that was the property manager on the other side go on the sidewalk okay so but i can't stand right here on this that's sidewalk? correct and i will trespass you if you're on the side, right, side trespass me make okay. an official trespass okay. i'll stand right here trespass me you're telling me i can't stand on this public sidewalk that's not a public sidewalk sir i just told make you sure about that the property man where make, you're standing is sir i just said that make sure that this isn't this a public sidewalk is not. make sure that that's starts, not a public sir? sidewalk you before you do it where the building is sir where the building starts right here I understand That's, what you're saying. I'm just saying make sure that you're, you're correct about it. Well, we are correct. We are correct, sir. Well, usually you're not. Usually That's fine, not. but today we are. It's sad. That's all you got to do is do this. A grown man. <laughs> Sorry, Sir, I'm sorry. 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 Sir, I'm s
you don't have the trespass button. You can't hear it get popped and my family comes in here and gets popped. You don't have the trespass button just because they want you to. But I've been I've been having phone calls from a whole bunch of people because they don't understand what you're doing. Um, and then like the customers keep talking to the employees about it and stuff. And it's like we've been here for 10 years and obviously I won't continue being here. Yeah. So like if you chose like a spot that maybe was a little less impactful on us personally, that'd be awesome. Well, I'm standing on a bu the busiest street corners in uh, Green Coast Springs. Uh, I'm standing on a bu the busiest street corners in uh, Green Coast Springs. It's expensive to be here, and I've been here for 10 years. This is what I'm saying. Like, uh, it's, are you like? The, are you the owner? Of, yes. Yeah. Of this, this is one? the next place. We pay five thousand dollars a month to do business right here. Okay. And stuff like this is not super awesome, especially when I get phone calls from everybody being like, "Hey, do you know?" I can't. Like I said, I can't help it if people got dirty minds, man. I can't help it if people got dirty. Yeah, money. no, I mean, that's true. And I can't help it if you put your $5,000 or whatever a month business right next to the public sidewalk at the busiest intersection in Green Coast Springs. I guess I should have had that. Uh, I should have known. Let me ask you this, and I'll just talk to you. All right. What's the difference, this corner versus any other three? Busiest corner we got in Green Coast Springs, as what far as I know. Foot traffic or just vehicle traffic? Vehicle traffic. I mean, that corner is just as busy. <laughs> I'm just talking about any one of these instead of right in front of there. Go with what I mean. I'm standing. I'm Nobody's standing. saying you're going to have to take the, the sign down. We get that. I understand right. that. I'm just saying. I understand the reason we got called in is because women were coming in. And I get can't help it. They have dirty minds or whatever. And they got kids coming in. The kids read that. And then, I mean, what does that mean? You know, mom's got to explain. You know how stupid this stuff is. It's, it's, but I'm just saying, why not that corner or that corner? Or this, why, why if if the they face? come up to me like, like some of the people did instead of jumping to conclusions, mm -hmm. uh, people come up to me and says, what does the sign mean? I see it says, I love Smith be coming. I explained it to you. Smith what v. Cumming. What is Smith v? What is that? Smith v. Cumming is, is case law out, yeah. of, out of Cumming, Georgia, C-U-M-M-I-N-G, okay. okay. which didn't give us the right, but affirmed our right mm -hmm. to film law enforcement officers. Right. I get it. All right. So it made it established case law. So from back, it was back in 2000. So since 2000, mm -hmm. any officer that arrests somebody for uh, filming mm -hmm. has no qualified immunity. Before right. that, they did because right. it wasn't established. So that's what I'm doing. I'm celebrating Smith v. Cumming. Right. That, that's your right, but I guess I guess back to my original question: Why didn't you make it everything big and bold? Where you can read everything. I mean, obviously you got what you needed. You well, got, I somebody actually got highlighted. Attention. I highlighted Smith and Green. Go ahead. Do you want this uh, Sure. What, what's going on? Okay. I just need some of your information. Are you willing to get that or no? No, I'm not giving any information. You want your copy? Sure. You guys already know who I am. Huh? You guys already know who I am. I, I actually, actually have no actually idea who you are. Oh, you. Okay. I don't believe that. Who are you? I don't believe that. My name is Jeff. You guys know who I am. I literally have no idea I who you are. Why do you think that we're so stupid? I've never run into you, so I've, I've never, never I've never even seen you before. You local here, Green Coast, or just Clay County, or what? Uh, I'm I'm from the '70s, actually. Okay. Well, I am too. Okay. Yeah. 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 Ye
Well, all right, there you have it, folks. If you come to the city of Green Coast Springs, Florida, to peacefully exercise your First Amendment protected right to freedom of speech on public property, um, the owner of Spring Park Coffee will call the police on you because he believes he owns the whole corner there because he allegedly pays $5,000 a month to pay rent for Spring Park Coffee. And uh, the Green Coast Springs Police will arrive and conspire with the owner, I believe his name is Stephen Kelly, to uh, run you off, get rid of you. And they uh, also trespassed me from Spring Park Coffee, which I could care less about. Uh, but this little portion of the sidewalk over here, you can see kind of to the right there, they're saying that's Spring Park Coffee property, which I disagree with. So I'll file a uh, trespass appeal hearing for that little portion of the sidewalk because if it's public property, they have they can't trespass me from it. But if it's private property, oh well, I don't give a shit. But uh, that's what happens in Green Coast Springs, Florida. If you uh, come out and peacefully exercise your right to freedom of speech, local businesses will conspire with the Green Coast Springs Police Department and try to uh, shut you down.